Angela Kelly is on the scene this morning. She's been live in Alloway um, updating us on the situation today. Good morning, Ange. Good morning, Rachel. Well, fire crews remain on the scene this morning. Uh, their main task right now to keep an eye out for any remaining hot spots. But as you can see, we've been allowed to get a little bit closer here to this apartment complex, really giving you a better view of the damage that was done here. You can see right inside of people's apartments. I'm seeing things still hanging on the wall, people's furniture, um, things scattered all over the lawn. And to think that just 24 hours ago, uh, many people were just at home in these apartments, living life, probably never expecting that something like this would happen. Now, I'm joining you live alongside of Mark Plate. He is a battalion chief for the Green Bay Fire Department. Um, are there any more remaining hotspots this morning? We have a couple of hotspots that uh, we're not been able to get to with all the uh, second uh, story that was uh, burned down into the first story. It's a uh, it's a big pile of stuff that we're not able to, to uh, get to. So we'll be here most of the day just watching it to make sure that uh, it doesn't go anywhere. Is it too early yet to say anything that may have caused this? Um, our investigating team is, is on scene right now. Um, after we get the uh, water pumped out of the basement, they'll be able to go in and uh, start their investigation. But right now it's still under investigation. Can you tell us anything about the three firefighters who suffered minor injuries yesterday? Is my understanding that they are all released. So nothing serious. Nothing serious. Okay, probably you know some people watching this morning who were displaced by this fire, and I know some of them have stopped here today, wondering, can I get in there to see if anything can be salvaged? Um, once the fire investigation is completed, uh, we'll work with the building owner and the Red Cross to, if there's any apartments that the people will be able to get back into, to get their belongings out, we'll work through them to get the people here to get some stuff out. Okay. Thank you so much for speaking with us this morning. Thank, Thank you. you. And we will continue to keep you updated on our website, fox11online.com, reporting live in Alloway. Back to you. Thanks, Angela.